Then sang Moses and the children of Israel this song unto the Lord, and spake, saying, I will sing unto the Lord, for he hath trumpeted gloriously, and the, the horse and his rider hath he thrown into the sea. And the Lord is my strength, that song, and he is became my salvation. He is my God. I will prepare him ha- an habitation. My Father is God, and I will exalt him. And the Lord is a man of war. The Lord is his name. Pharaoh's chariots and his host hath he cast into the sea. He's, his chosen captains are also also are drowned in the Red Sea. The deeps uh, uh, have covered them. They sank into the bottom as a stone. The, thy right hand, O Lord, is become glorious in power. Thy right hand, O Lord, hath dashed in pieces the enemy. And in the greatness of thy excellency, thou hast overthrown them that throws up against thee thou sentst forth thy wars which consumed them as stubble and with the blast of thy nostrils the water were gathered together the floods stood upright as a sheep and heap and the deeps were congelled in the heart of the floods A heart of the sea. The enemy said, I will pursue, I will overtake, I will divide the spoil. My lust shall be satisfied upon them. I will draw my sword, and my hand shall destroy them. Thou didst below us with thy with the sea cover them. They sank as lead in the mighty waters. Who is like uh, who is like unto thee, O Lord, among the gods? Who is like thee, glorious in holiness, fearful in praise, doing wonders? Uh, thou stretchedest out thy hand, the earth swallowed them. Thou in thy mercy hast led forth the people which thou hast redeemed, thou hast guided them in thy strength unto the holy habitation. The people shall hear and be afraid. Sorrow shall take hold on the habitation of Palestine. The, the, then the dukes of Edom shall be amazed. The mighty men of Moab, trembling, shall take hold upon them. All the habitations of Canaan shall melt away melt away for fear and dread dread shall fall upon them by the greatness of thine army the thy they shall be as stone still as as a stone till thy people pass over o lord till the people pass over which thou hast purchased thou thou shalt bring them in the planet them in the mountain of thine inheritance in the people all in the pla- in the place O lord wh- which thou hast made for thee to dwell in the sanctuary O lord which thy hands have established the all the the lord shall reign reign forever and ever <coughs> For the horse of Pharaoh went in with his chariots and with his horsemen into the sea, and the Lord brought again the water of the sea upon them. But the children of Israel went on dry land in the midst of the sea, and and Miriam, the prophetess, uh, the sister of Aaron, took the timbre in her hand and all... (coughs) <clears throat> and all the women went out after her with timbrels and with dances. And Miriam answered them, saying, Yeah, to the Lord, for he hath trumpeted gloriously. <clears throat> the horse 
and his rider has he thrown into the sea. So Moses brought Israel from the Red Sea, and they went out into the wilderness of Shur. And they went three days in the wilderness and found no water. And when they came to Marah, they could not drink of the waters of Marah, for they were bitter. Therefore, the name of it was called Marah. And uh, the people murmured against Moses, saying, What shall we drink? And he cried unto the Lord, and the Lord shewed him a tree, which when he had cast it, he cast in the into the water of the waters were made sweet uh, where where he made for them a statue and an ordinance and there he proved them and said if thou wilt diligently hearken to the voice of the lord thy god and wilt do that which is right in his sight uh, and will will to give ear to his commandments and Keep all his statutes. I will put none of these diseases upon thee, which I have brought upon the Egyptians, for I am the Lord that healed thee. And they came to Elim, where the uh, where the where where were twelve wells of water, and three score and ten palm trees, and they camped there by by the waters.